So I just got my Walkera Runner 250 in the mail and uh, it did come with the 800 VTL 5.8 megahertz first person view camera but I decided to just go ahead and make this thing just a, a regular quadcopter so I lost the camera the top what would be GoPro stabilizing mount plate uh, and the actual transmitter module couple of screws and all together it lost 73 grams so there that is and I've tried to fly this thing at night a couple of times it's not great it's kind of good when it's just going away from you or just coming right back towards you but there's no real good orientation once you get pretty high in the sky so I went on ahead and added some auxiliary lighting on the bottom. I did the green in the front and the red to kind of go with the red theme in the back. Unfortunately, it's really windy tonight, but I did take it up for a few minutes and it looks like it's going to work really well. Um, to be honest with you, I haven't been really happy with the flight characteristics. I have been tampering with the Devo 7 a little bit, trying to dial it in a little bit more on the response. Seems like there's a lot of play in the stick before you actually get a hard movement. Not to mention having to do the whole... Sorry, I did hear there's a firmware update that will fix this problem, but the whole flip of death it's real it is real believe me so I went into the sub trims and kept pressing down and about 13.5 the motors will kick on uh, leave it there and then you're gonna have to turn your throttle hold on and uh, it's pretty simple you just turn on the transmitter unlock the motor like you normally would but the motors will not spin until the throttle holds taken off so it actually works pretty well so I'm getting a little more comfortable flying it and definitely happy with that new mod I just hardwired into the front LEDs and I put one of those micro low C connectors I think maybe and connected it like that I don't see any flickering or I don't see any light drop when I hit the throttle so it seems like that setup's gonna work pretty well pretty stoked pretty clean I ran the lines pretty clean I had to do a pigtail from one side to make the positive connection to the low C connector. But like I said, it turned out pretty well. Everything's pretty clean, pretty tight to the walls. So I shouldn't catch any flutter from flight or anything like that. There it is.